Hi everyone, Dark Shadow Plays here, and we're back again for a little bit more Road 96, and this time it is episode 6. I normally do this on stream, but I haven't streamed this weekend, um, so I figured I'd do a video for YouTube. Um, after the mess up I had last time with kind of streaming and recording, and OBS deciding it didn't want to play ball with me anymore, um, we'll just do a straight run here. Obviously on the last one we died, but Zoe has escaped. Zoe is over the border now, so we probably well, we won't see her anymore because she's got 100% of her story. But now, we need to find out what the next stage is. Hello, Sonia Sanchez here. Welcome to the Sonia Show. On today's show, we'll take a look at our nation's booming oil industry. With the help of our Minister of Oil, we recorded the following. Just a moment, I have some very important news to share. <gasps> You're kidding me. Ladies and gentlemen, let's go live to our reporter at the wall. Tense. Beatrice, can you hear me? Yes, Sonia. I'm here at the wall where an attack has just happened. With me is Darren, who oh, witnessed yes. the event. I'm on? Yeah, so I was sleeping in my tent when I heard a bang. Like a big explosion, you know. When I got out, I saw a huge fire at the wall. Do you know what caused the explosion? I, I think a truck smashed into it. That's right, Sonia. A brigade truck crashed into the wall, killing a teenager on the spot. Nah, you got it wrong. The truck didn't kill the teen. Border forces did. They're shooting kids all the time. It's me. Hey, don't grab my mic. Uh-oh. Looks like we're having some technical difficulties. <laughs> Wish I could say I'm surprised the brigades are behind this, but I can't. Thank you for your report, Beatrice. Have no fear. The authorities will ensure nothing like this occurs on election day. Remember, I'll be there live. Now let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate polls. Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. No. As we approach election day, more and more protests are occurring in our fine country. Don't support the violence, vote for Tyrak. As you know, the Sonia Show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. But who are we going to be today? Uh, Remember, this one's been missing for 20 days. Not got much energy, though. Please call the <clears throat> Sonia hotline. So I tend to always go for the one with the most energy, but this one has the most money um, and the most distance to go. So let's go for this and one. that has been the Sonia Show. So, we are likely to meet all of those characters, including Jared, who does scare the crap out of me, but uh, we will see who we meet first. It's a sunny, sunny day in not-so-beautiful Petria. Let's get serious, indeed. Right. So, is this John? I've only got two energy, so I do need to be uh, conscious that I need to find some food. Hello, John? No? Alright, well, let's. Uh, don't want to vandalise that. Well, let's see if we can use the ATM. We don't, still don't have a card. Uh, I can pick this lock, though. Let's expect to find some food or something back here. Or tape or anything. Uh, let's pick the lock. Take a car key. That's always good. Nothing else in here though, no food. Okay, switch. Ooh, lights. Didn't help me though. Okay, well that's that's that done. Yeah. <clears throat> I still haven't found I've found all the phone numbers and things as well, so that might be something I want to do. Uh uh. Chucks isn't open right now. Renovation. Okay. Uh but I hear music inside. Music? No, you don't. I'm pretty sure I do. Uh, I need to use a bathroom. You and that skinny guy. Go on, but make it quick. There's a skinny guy in there. I win. Hand over those bills, Stop. Robert. Well, I'm out. Anyone else want a shot at this guy? Aha, uh -huh. not me. Papa Bear's made an air hockey pack from Satan. <laughs> <laughs> Weaklings, all of you. But what about you, kid? I'll give it a shot. I like air hockey. Ourselves a contender. 
Oh, like a Wild West film. Faster three points wins. Let's do this. All right, let's do this indeed. I do like a bit of air hockey in real life as well, so. <laughs> Not that I'm very good at this one. Oh god, it's so fast. Oh no, too slow now. I nearly killed myself then. No! Dang it. Oh, I'm not going to try to. Come on in, John. <gasps> that was close. Oh, come on! Oh, I don't want to lose this. Hey, straight down. The wall. Yeah, we've met you in a previous episode, mate. Oh, that was <laughs> the easiest shot, right? Game point. That was close. Pretty sure he's scripted to win, but we'll find out. I win. Please don't, John. I like you. Fair and square. Good. Got fifteen bucks. Come on, drinks all round. I'm pay. Sweet. That might be some energy as well. Not on the Olympic squad. Uh, you keep asking. John was an excellent goalkeeper in his younger years, but came up short of making the national team. Guess it still bothers him. There are a lot of things that bother me, Robert. Oh, you're not. It's just that John's still living in the past. Chuck, serve this girl, Amata. Here we go. Amata? You sure about that, Robert? Our friend here is practically an adult, aren't you? Uh, yeah, sure am. I'm gonna be drunk. Doesn't give me any energy, okay. I did. Makes me sick, them saying the brigades did it. What about you? What do you think? I wish I could 100% agree, but I've seen many politicians come and go. It's true. My name is Robert, kid. Nice to meet you. I didn't want to provoke him by saying I saw him in the motel, but I think I know who he is. You know, I do believe there's a reason you're here today. <clears throat> Maybe you should push on, young bud. It's getting late. Oh, I'm now tired. Whoa, young bud. You okay? You look a little funny. I'm fine. I'm fine. What did you put in that drink? The murder? Everything. <laughs> well, well, well. At least I'll have had a nap. Do I get more energy for that? No. I need some food. Kid, wake up. I'm awake. Wake up. I'm awake. Stop batting me about. Haha, <laughs> I see. Come on. I want to show you something. Something big. Uh Okay. Can't move. Welcome to the brigade's secret hideout. Eat the food. Move book. Is there anything else in here? Take that. That. I should take the door key as well. Just gotta loot everything. Hello. John Whoop. and I were at the border in '86. Uh -huh. The brigades have been around for many years. Okay, I see now. A girl crossed recently. We think she's the catalyst the revolution needs. So that'll be Zoe, who crossed last episode. Can I vandalize this one? No? Okay. Come on, I'll show you. What's the kid doing here, Robert? Open this, no. 
The kid's political. Besides, aren't we on the lookout for fresh blood? It is. You know, you could become a brigade if you wanted to. This is very cool. Nothing's <laughs> stopping you. <laughs> Not Let me lie. start with a big piece of news. Thanks to Zoe, we have intel showing that Tyrak was behind the collapse. Just like we've always suspected. You're just like us, kid. We tried to end his life that day, but he set off the explosives on the peak. Okay. Each year, they set it off to prevent avalanches. Must have set off too much in 86. I have some other big news. I have a plan to rig a Tyrak billboard. Will attract cops to it by broadcasting a fake signal. Why cops? When they arrive, boom, we trigger the device. This isn't a huge move, but it's a good start and will send a strong message. Do I have any volunteers? Yeah, go on, why not? That's great, kid. But I think we'll go with hardened brigades here. Oh. I'll do it, Robert. This isn't who we are. They're sending teens to the work camp, John. Protests aren't cutting it. And Flores sure as hell won't cut it either. Robert's right. We need to attack. Now. Alex, our little genius, will help us rig the device. Hey, little Alex. If all goes well, he can build us something bigger and badder for election day. The kid's out, Robert. He doesn't want to be involved in this. For Christ's sakes, his mom's a cop. We don't need Alex. We can find somebody else to do this. I'm telling you all. Violence will do more harm than good. Funny, don't you think, kid? Funny because John and his girlfriend were the ones who drove the truck to kill Tyrak in 86. I've changed, Robert. Yes, you have. Look, we should vote and settle this right now. Who thinks the brigades need to be more aggressive? I don't. I do. I do. I refrain. I don't. I don't. I do. Free against free. Hey. Let's ask the kid. She's here after all. Mmm, that's why you brought her in. To vote on your side. Who Incredible. we think we need kid, to be more violent. Uh I was gonna say violence isn't the answer. Now you need to attack. Good. Then it's decided. John probably hates me for that. Go on the offensive. Voted for violence. Hmm. Don't normally do that, but okay. <clears throat> Guys, picked it up on the scanner. The police on their way. We all know what we need to do. Get in our cars and leave calmly. Kid, no need to worry. They'll never suspect you. Yeah, everything just faded to black, though. Hey, kid, want to play? We can put down some money if you want. Let's do it. Go. Let's play. <laughs> Whoops. That's better. Even the score. That was easy. Ah. Whoop. You win fair and square. Here's your money. Good. That's another 20 bucks. Another game? Uh, no, I'm alright, thanks. Uh, you got anything to say to me? No, nope, you look drunk. Um, and I'll buy some more food. Uh, oh, that's that door. Okay. What can I do for you, kid? Uh, let's order something. Buy food. It's better. Thank you very much. Uh, and about the kiddie died. did. But kids are dying all the time in the pits. Hundreds of them. And we never hear a word about that. Okay, well, you're not saying anything else, that's fine. Hello, Nothing coppers. See here, kid. Okay. Let's, uh. Anything in here? Let's go to this toilet here. That'll be loud. Ooh, search. I've got a tape. I can I knock? Why is there wood in that one? What the heck? Okay, we'll look at the tape from this one, that's fine. I don't need to order anything else. I can just leave now, I think. 
I'll have to take my car. I'm just gonna go vandalize these posters real quick. Oh, bit of lag there. Thank you. I eventually want to phone those things. Oh, I can pay for a bus. Okay, I haven't taken the bus before. Or I can phone a taxi. I'll make call home, actually. Uh, let's call home. Always worthwhile calling home. Hello? It's me. I've been waiting for you to call. How are you? Making progress. Oh, good. Everyone's talking about you. Good. Most? That you're a traitor. No surprise, I guess. Bit harsh. Kind of lame to say, but I miss you. And don't worry, uh, your fish are fine. Oh, good. <laughs> Thanks for helping me. Okay. Well, that's fine. I think we... Uh, I'm going to call... Actually, I'm going to go vandalise this post quick. Bear with me. Thank you very much. Uh, so it's 96112, isn't it? Yeah. I'm going to phone it and I'm going to see what happens. I don't want to dob John in, of course, because John is my friend, or at least he's on my side. Uh, so let's go use. See what this comes up with, because there's lots of story that gets involved, uh, unrolled via the uh, phones. This is the Sonya hotline. Please note, any false information will result in criminal prosecution. Uh, hang on. <laughs> I don't want to be prosecuted. Right, so let's get the bus, because we haven't taken a bus yet. And who are we going to see on the bus? It won't be the copper, at least I wouldn't have thought so. That's a funny looking bus. We even moved? I don't think that moved. <laughs> Is it going to be Alex on the bus, do we reckon? Although he drives, so. Welcome aboard, kid. Thanks. Um... Yeah. And you? Mm. Are you frightened? Sometimes. I know it's tough, but. Try not to think about it. Okay, then. You look like a Newton Falkner. What you should do now is rest. If you can. Oh, his head just went... Better. Okay. Is that all I can do? There's Sonya on TV. Yeah, that's pretty much all we can do here. There's no... Oh, check behind. You still got something from it. Can't do anything else in here, so we will just rest. Well, that's why you don't take the bus. Loads of energy now. That's good. I was worried about energy at the start of this one. Awake, eh? I am indeed. He's not. Nothing there. Uh, where's the other passenger? You got off while you were asleep. That was kinky. Okay. Um, can you drop me here? Yeah, fine by me. Got a very strange accent, but all right. Fine by me. All right, we've gone five, six, seven hundred, eight hundred miles. Wow, a thousand miles nearly. That's a long old bus ride. <laughs> okay, we've still got a couple of stories to go as well. Well, this is going to be Jared, isn't it? next here. Jump around! Everybody jump! Jump! And a bit of crisscross. Well, I can kick a stone. Right, I'm going to break my toes on this, but I'm going to kick it again. I can kick it on too! Which one can I kick further? Okay, well, that's fine. Alright, let's keep going. There is a bus stop by the looks of it up here. Some pumps and things over there. Can't get over the road, can I? No, it still doesn't let me cross the road. Uh, 
yeah, so that's the missing teams, five, 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 five. I don't want to vandalise you. Or you. I will vandalise you. I will vandalise you. Okay, so there's no buses. Abe or something? No? This is a very uh, empty mission bit. Why would I go for the bus here? Is it to see this beautiful sunrise? Oh, that was kind of cool. Uh, let's hitchhike then. Let's see who picks me up. How far is this going to take me? It didn't seem to take me anywhere at all. What was the point of hitchhiking? I don't even know what the point was getting a flat bus. Stand a bitch. <laughs> I like the number plate. It's the ride. Hey, kid! On your travels, have you met a woman named Sonia? I have indeed. Oh. You'd know if you had. She's only the prettiest flower in all of Petria. Okay. Sharp as a tack, too. But now, some traveling news. Sonia is in danger. Uh, oh no, that is troubling. Someone wants to end sweet Sonia's life. Our plan is to stop this would-be killer. Before they kill Sonia. Yeah, before. Well, that's helpful. Our hunch is the psycho is a taxi driver. What we know is this creep plans to attack Sonia Keep it on the road. And that this creep plans to do so on election day. It's certain. No, but like we say, this taxi driver is a psycho. Okay. Taxi I mean, he is. Driver? That would make sense. What doesn't stand is why the kid's in the sidecar. It being in the shape it is. Uh, what's wrong with the sidecar? I and scared the kid, Mitch. Yeah, didn't I? Oh, shoot. Ask us a question if you'd like. Could take your mind off your fear. Oh, great. Uh, did you hear about the teen who died? Got the feeling something big's coming. Yeah. Oh yeah, me and Mitch were just talking about that. Yeah, it's, it's like the air is crackling with electricity. <laughs> you don't say. Long as you lean into the turns. Oh goody. Sure. Just move left and right. Give it a whirl. Whoa, whoa, no <laughs> sight, kid. Okay. Is it gonna ask me to do it again, no? Not bad. I can't turn that way. I don't see. Oh, okay, that was great. Yes. That's Thought there'd be another turn. Get on up here, little lady. Don't be scared. Let's do this. Go on then. What do you think, kid? Yeah. What do you think? It's amazing. Could you, could you stay? Stay, please. Where's that taxi driver? A taxi driver. Oh, could be Sonia's would-be killer. Get back in the sidecar and help us catch that cab. You're doing okay, keep going. He's getting away. It's on the steering section, which is fine. Oh, that was close. Ooh. He's getting away. Stan, we need to go faster. I'm trying. I didn't know, Mitch. Ah. 
Oh, that's nice. Yeah, like I can't, I can't do anything about that because I can't make it go faster. Purely a bit close to it. We are going quite fast, anyway. We can't have been that far ahead of us. Come on. What are you doing over there, man? Right, you were on the wrong side of the road. Did we go? The taxi stopped! Could be a trap. Could be. It's Jared, after all. Show this driver the beast, Mitch! With pleasure. It's Jared. Ooh. Here we go. This had to be good. So, kid, did you get a look at the driver? That's my recollection, too. Wait until Mitch gets his hands on this creep. Ooh. What the? What's going on? Why is he coming back? Oh, nice person. People like that don't deserve engine trouble. If I... He's leaving! That wasn't the would-be killer, Stan. Way it's too him. nice. You let Sonia's would-be killer go, Mitch! I did not. Besides, I didn't see you get off the bike. You were scared. <laughs> I was not scared. These are you were scared. Right. Uh, let's look on the bright side. We're getting closer. We are. We almost got that psycho this time. Stand and match. What do you want to do now, little lady? Um. I think I'll get out now. Yourself, kid. Yeah, just throw me off the cliff, it's fine. I don't particularly want to be anywhere near Jared. We went a long way on that journey, though. 600 miles on a bike. I want to be all that comfortable. Well, that's a lot of energy gone. I need to find some food. Nothing but a G thing. I don't have an inventory or anything, do I? No. It would show in the top right-hand corner, maybe? This could be another one where I'm just running to do nothing. Yeah, I think it is. Looks pretty, though. Stuck on something there. Come on, me. Right, up and over the mountain again. I definitely need some food. I don't want to hit truck this time, I don't think. I think I'm going to carry on walking because there's nothing else here. Oh, there might be something here actually. Forgot about this one last time. Uh, we can rest. That will give me some energy back, so we will rest. Don't think it changes the story if you rest, it just changes the, uh, the times. Oh, I only got one energy back, but that's, that's okay. I don't want to hit truck this time, I am going to walk. There's a car there, or a vehicle. Might be something there. And I 
at him. Ooh, there's something here. Can I hack you? I can hack you. Definitely upgrades thing. Um, I can't use that. I don't even know what that is. Uh, we can play a tape. We can open that. Nothing in there. Take some money though. 45 bucks, that's quite nice. And then. We've got all the tapes. We've got all of the tapes. found a new place that we hadn't been to before and oh we have a thing here as well Petrian Times nation who closed door on attack on September the 9th 10 years after the cowardly brigade attack the nation will honor the victims who died that terrible day and elect its next president hundreds are expected for the nationally televised event cool thanks for that is that Jared no, it's just a burned out taxi, it's fine. It is not Jared, we are okay. Anything we can do with this? No. Let's keep going then. Long walk. Still work, walked quite a far away. What's next? Oh, I need some fuel. Food. Fuel? No. It's Alex. Hello, Alex. Short circuit. Number five is alive. Oh, okay. I thought he was underground for a second then. That lake. It's green. Oh, let's have a vandalise of all of these then. Right, you're 10,000 bucks. Wow. <sighs> that feels better. Ugh, I don't get it. I've tried everything. Clearly not, Alex. Bear with me a second and I will come and help. Guess I'm just a normal genius. Not a genius genius. Yo. <laughs> Depressing. Hey, homegirl, come inside before somebody sees you. This is my secret hideout, yo. Okay then. Don't mind me while I just vandalize everything outside. Like everything, everything. Oh, it's a light. Ooh. Ladder that I can't climb up, but we're gonna check the trash. Always worth it. Eat the rotting food, at least he gives me something. It doesn't make you sick, so that's fine. Okay. Just... Don't mind me. Oh, I can't get out of there anyway. Uh, anything behind here? I could play some music, but don't want to. What are you doing here? I've been working on this thing for three days straight, but I still can't figure it out. It's making a bomb. Whoa, is that well, a... it's a prototype. You can't actually detonate it. Oh, okay. I've been designing it for this guy I know, Robert. Mm, just a guy I know. I know who it is. I think he wants it to protect this group he's in. They're called the Black Brigades. I'm a Black Brigade. Don't know yet, but it seems like something big is going to go down. Or up. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see, I guess. Wait, I got an idea. You can be my rubber duck. I'm not having a bath with you. A rubber duck is someone who listens to someone else describe a problem. If all goes well, the solution presents itself to the person talking. Oh, okay. Quack. Cool, yeah. cool. So first I check the resistance with my voltmeter, and everything seems okay. Quack. Then I clean the captors, checking them too. A bit painstaking, but whatever. You're a genius! <laughs> to turn on the electricity, we need to find the generator. Could be anywhere at this station. Grab this nail gun. 
I got another idea. Okay. See the cable in the ceiling? I do. Shoot the tiles to see where it goes. That's how we'll find the generator. Ooh, what's that? Ah, hang on. Oh god, I just jumped off something. <laughs> right, uh Oh that's broken, so it's this one. Put a cap in the ceiling tiles, homegirl. See where this kid goes. Wasn't expecting to play in Quake. Right, we should follow That's this one. It, home girl. It's going outside. Let's oh, I just it. shot him in the face. <laughs> oh, God. Hoping I get to shoot someone with this. The sort of. going outside. The cable's running on the ground. Let's follow it. Lead the way. Tell me when you find where it goes. I'm coming. Hey, Hell yeah. The generator is in here, yo. We just got to start it now. The key should be around here somewhere. Uh, there's the key there. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, you okay, homegirl? Yeah, thanks for that. Oh, wait. Try with this magnet. Right, so I don't want to touch anything that's sparkly, sparkly. Go slow, homegirl. No, I'm cool. Slow. I'm cool. I'm cool. Do these things at the fair all the time. That's it. Yeah. It's actually quite tense. Rabbits, there we go. Nice. Oh, Zeus, give me your power. <laughs> All right, let's start the generator. Oh, the phone works as well now. Cool. Come on, let's go back. Whoop. Who are you? We got company. Hide. I'm hiding. The lights are on. But the station sure is in bad shape. You know, that's why we need Tarak for another ten years, and not that Flores. To make sure this kind of thing doesn't happen elsewhere. Okay. Hey, wanna scare these Tyrak supporters a little? Sure. The cable goes under their car. I can make it active. And their car, too. Yeah, this place looks closed. Foreigners and teens. They're ruining Petria. I don't sure if I want to press that button. <laughs> <laughs> Quit fooling around, Jim. I just got electrocuted Dutch in the car. What of accent is that? That's one of your jokes, isn't it? No. See for yourself. Why would I try to electrocute Dang. myself? Fine. Let me press it. Let me press it. Let me press it. I don't feel nothing. Gotta touch the car. I wasn't lying. Ah! <laughs> 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 uh, see, I told you. I didn't believe you. I know. Hey, look over there. Oh, Oops. Time to run, homegirl. Yeah, we're all gonna get caught. Oh no, we're fine. We're fine. I think they've gone. Yeah, they've gone. I want to press the button again. It was fun. Is Alex still here? I don't know, but I definitely need some food. You're... 
There's no food down there. Can't go out that way. Can we get out here? I don't think there was anything out here, was there? No. Okay, well, I think that's that. I don't think I found the keys for that either. Yeah, I don't know the keys. There must be somewhere inside, actually. But uh, let's call the taxi this time, then. We have $77, so... It'll be Jared. Happy taxi. How can we help you today? I need ride. We'll send a taxi to your location right away. Thanks. Thank so bucks. It's fine. Happy taxi. You sounded so happy. Eight miles, that's not far. And it's not far at all. Who are we gonna meet this time? Still think it's probably Jared. Informer. It's not Jared. Okay, that's fine. That mirror doesn't work the way it's supposed to. <laughs> Take that. Let's uh, give it a scratch. We've got a dollar? Yeah. Anything else? I don't want to rest. I'm going to not. No, he's not interested in talking then, is he? Ah, oh, there we go. Had to knock three times. So, where are we headed? Toward the border. Oh, well, just don't go any farther than that. It's illegal, you know. Why not? But, uh, yeah, sure. I'll take you in that direction. What an impolite thing to say. What? It's growing on you. Nice. Yeah, okay. Well, that was kind of boring. Nine miles to the border. So we didn't get much progression in this one. Stan Mitch and Alex was the two that we really met, but that's fine. I'm now on one energy. I'm not even sure if I'm going to make it. Okay, well, let's carry on. We're going to climb like Miley Cyrus. The lock. Some money in there. Not that I necessarily need it, but I'll take it. If we get to the cave, I might leave some behind again for someone else. What is that helicopter doing? Where is it? It's always over this way, but I can't see it. Why has the breathing changed so much? It's freaking me out. safe I think so we choose to go that way if we want but it just takes us around the other side so we'll just go this way up to the old waterfall again which we like how will we spray paint something this time let's go for revolt I'm not a down before That's actually a pretty cool piece of art. Right, add a stone. Thank you. I've been achieving for that stone after stone. Let me pop some money down behind here as well. Oh, there's a note. To the person who left some money uh, here, I heard rumours about this rock, but didn't think it actually existed. Anyway, I don't know who you are. If you're a crosser like me, but thanks, I really mean it. Because you want to have a chance to leave this hellhole once and for all. Okay, well, let's leave some money. Uh, leave money. Let's leave 40 bucks. 35 for me is fine. And then 
we go across. Really need some energy. Very miles to the border. We are hopefully going to make it. I'm not too sure if we do. But this will be where we take action. That stall is in, I'll definitely buy some food. Oh, Sonia's car's here. And Stan and Mitch's bike. So this could In be interesting. just a few days, the nation will honor the victims of 86 and elect its new president. When historians look back on this September 9th, many will consider it the most important day ever in the history of Petria. It's perfect. The entire country will be watching. I agree. The time to act is now. Hey, is that me? It's Tyra. Intelligence says the brigades will try something, Mr. President. If they do, I'll crush them once and for all. Ooh. Of course, I'll be here all day, reporting live at the scene. This has been Sonia Sanchez for GNN. And cut! You do her hair, is that it? I don't do her hair. Don't be offended. We think her hair is great. Look, Sonia's not seeing anyone right now, all right? Hi, kid. This guy won't let us see Sonia. He thinks we're fans. Aren't we, Stan? <laughs> we're... we're more than that. We're her biggest fans. Nice one, Stan. Yeah, yeah you heard the kid. And who are you? Uh, just get well, whoever you are, get out of here. That goes for you two, also. Come on, Mitch. We made the hairstylist <laughs> upset. We'll talk to Sonia later. Oh, are you crying, Sonia? A girl died here in '86. Lots of girls die here in '86. What are you talking about? Oh, you might as well do it now. This is for you, Lola. Wait, no, don't. Lola was her name. I, I, I tried. I tried to save her. But, but the rocks, they, they kept coming. I wasn't expecting that. It's just, sometimes, I wish I had died. And she lived. Oh, Sonia. Mitch, behind the rocks. You see what I'm seeing? Uh-huh. Come on. No, we've got to stop him. Stop right there! You again. Wait, where's the other one? Mitch, the beast! <laughs> what the? Oh, no. Woohoo! We got him, Mitch! We got the would-be killer! Woohoo! Wait, you know these two S and M guys? No, damn. Oh. We are the big brothers. Hi, Sonia. Oh, hi, Sonia. <laughs> well, you I wasn't expecting come that. Come here and give me a hug. No. <laughs> right away, yeah. ma'am. On our way. Is Jared dead? It's so good to see you too. It's been too long. He's not dead. I don't want to rain on your family reunion, but he's gone. Not a problem. We'll be here on election day, if he comes back. Yeah, we'll be here. Stan! Aw, oh, Mitch. Oh, I'm sorry I've been so distant. I hope you can forgive me. Don't worry about it, Sonia. Yeah, don't worry. We're, we're a family. Aw, oh, you guys are the best. Now give me another hug. Hmm. 
So is Jared? They'll no, he's not there. just the brigades. Time to cut the head off the snake. Maybe I'm on the wrong side. Well, is that going to take my last bit of energy? Drinks? Can I help you at all? Uh, we'll stick three dollars to fortune pick. Might as well. Some items to help you on your journey. I'll take some food and I'll take some drink. Uh, don't know who stand it'd be if it wasn't. Yeah, all right. I don't know, kid, but I think it's gonna be big. Just hope the good guys come out on top. Yep. But I know history isn't necessarily on our side. Kid, you've got to be smarter than that. Security is all over the place. They'll send you to you know where. And my wife and I will end up in prison. Oh, sorry. Can we trust you? Of course. Okay. You could try to convince a guard to let you enlist. Enlist? You seem smart. Just follow the line of trucks to the gate. I hope you find your freedom, kid. We'll be rooting for you. Okay, so let's go and try and enlist. The only thing is, I know there's a path that way. I'm going to try the gateway. Can I, uh... Can I vandalise first? No. Here for the offshore worker exam? Sure. Are you registered? Of course. Mm, everything looks in order. You can head inside. Okay, I've got to take a test. Why am I taking a test? <laughs> it was a red chair. Um, hello. Welcome. You're here for the offshore ah. worker test. If you fail, it's because you have lied and you will be detained. Oh. It's too late to leave. Try, and you will also be detained. Seems a bit suspicious. The test will be difficult. Only the most honest citizens will pass. Your number will be displayed behind me. When it appears, it's your turn. Your test results will also be displayed there. So pay attention. There are certain requirements you need to know. Only married persons with at least one child can rightfully apply. Okay. Your contract, if you pass, will last for five years. Okay. No more, no less. Lastly, the majority of your pay will be sent back to your homeland. Oh. Your number will soon be displayed. Bless our beautiful nation. Am I 13? I don't know what my number is. What are you doing? Your number's on the screen. Get in there. I can't move. Okay. Whoa. Ready? Yes. Quiet. Let us begin. Question one. 13. What is your candidate number? Question two. How old is your eldest child? Uh, five years old. Strange. You look very young. Oh, yeah, and I'm fine. Question three. If you pass, how long will your stay abroad be? Five years. Question four. What age would your eldest child be when you oh, return What did I say? What did I say? Ten. Question five. Are you, or have <laughs> you ever been, a black brigade? Yes. Uh, brigade? No. Question six. Have you ever listened to illegal radio stations? Be honest. No. Question seven. When did the Black Brigade terror 86. attack occur? Uh, ah. Question nine. Who <laughs> is our great president? Boris. Um, all right. Question 11. Which of the following do you enjoy the most? Uh, patrolling with Patriots. You have case. answered all the questions. Petria is a democratic country. So you have the opportunity to ask at this time a question of your own. Oh, okay. Um, I have nothing to ask now. Good I'm not, not, to ask questions. not going to ask that question. You can now wait for your test results in the waiting room. Okay. 
Hopefully you'll not be arrested. Good day. Good day, sir. You look young to take this test. I'm older than I look. Oh. Don't worry, I won't say anything. Good. God, I hope he passes us. I passed. Woo! Did you pass? What can I do? Can I move? Oh, hello. You're so creepy. Number 13, you have passed. Stand up and leave. Oh, I'm out of here. Well, represent our blessed nation. Well, that is a successful crossing. Bit of a weird one to do, but uh, it's fine. We made Freedom. it in the end. Nothing is more important, but there are many others in Petra still looking for it. Well, they're going to blow it up on election day then. And their journeys have only just begun. Okay. So they didn't really show anything after that one. I'm guessing that was kind of a mid-ending, if you like. So there we go, we've got one more episode to go, uh, which we will do next week. Um, if you want to see that episode, obviously, come back next week and we'll see if we can finish off some stories. Um, other than that, thanks very much for watching. We had a bit of a quiet episode there. It was. Uh, it felt very much like a middle of the trilogy, <laughs> so to speak. Um, obviously, episode six. But anyway, um, I will see you guys for another episode of Road 96 next week.